Hello and welcome to the user interface of MyDustGen software. Today we will see the building generation feature and automatic story generation feature of MyDustGen. So I have already modeled the first floor of the building and also I have uh, applied the floor loads to that floor. And when we copy uh, the floors using building generation option, all these load will be copied to the other floors also. So for that, you need to go to control data and then uh, building generation. Here you need to define the number of copies you want. Suppose I want to have a 10th floor. So I will type it here as a 10 and define the height, uh, story height and then click on add. After this, I will select the story which I want to copy. So I am here selecting all and then click on apply. Now you can see that the first floor is being copied to all other 10 floor. And you can also notice that the load which has been applied to the first floor is now been applied to all other floors which is generated so click go to floor load and click on display you can notice that the loads has been copied now we can see the story generation option of medasgen so for that go to control data then story now here uh, in the story tab if you go and click on auto generate story data, the pop up window will open and here this is the listed floor of the particular building with the level and then we can also include accidental eccentricity and wind eccentricity also and if you click on OK, the story, story data is automatically generated and also the floor diaphragm is automatically considered for the particular floors. Now, if you want to see the created diaphragm by the program, you can go to the display option and see the diaphragms for the particular floors. So go to boundary tab and then check on story diaphragm and click on OK. So you can see the diaphragm created uh, by the program for the floors. Now, if you don't want to consider a story diaphragm for any other floor, you can go and select the do not consider option in the story data. And for that floor, the story diaphragm will not be considered by the program. So you can go to story and story data, click on do not consider in the floor diaphragm column. And for that particular floor, now the diaphragm will not be considered. So as you can see here in the model, the story diaphragm for the top floor is now not being considered by the program. So this is how you can use the building generation option and story generation option in MyDASGen. Thank you.